David Ricardo was a classical economist best known for his theory on wages and profit, the labor theory of value, the theory of comparative advantage, and the theory of rents. David Ricardo and several other economists also simultaneously and independently discovered the law of diminishing marginal returns. His most well-known work is the Principles of Political Economy and Taxation. He was known for his brilliant ideas about the effect of natural resources like land in the development of the economy. According to his principle of the law of diminishing marginal returns, the increasing number of people will drive man to cultivate idle lands to support necessities in life. This will happen due to depletion of fertile lands. The law of supply and demand is the underlying principle of the neoclassicists, a group where John Maynard Keynes belong. According to Keynes the government plays a significant role in maintaining equilibrium in the economy through public spending and keeping the balance among demand, supply, and the market prices. John Maynard Keynes is the father of modern employment theory and wrote the book General Theory of Employment, Interest, and Money. Karl Marx, father of communism, shared his principles and ideals regarding the cause of poverty of the proletariat or working class is caused by abusive practices of the rich capitalists that safeguard their own selfish interests and their accumulation of wealth. According to Marx, all industries and other sources of wealth should be nationalized so as to achieve equality among the people. Karl Marx is an advocate of communism. He wrote the Das Kapital, a book that contains the teaching of communism. Some communist leader like Mao Zedong of China, Vladimir Lenin of Russia and Fidel Castro of Cuba.